Remember how we've always been told that Mars is a desolate, dry, dead planet with nothing much going on? Well, something really interesting was revealed in a NASA JPL talk. About a week ago, let's have a look at the photographs as well as some quotes that are really interesting. The photographs I'll be showing you are screenshots taken from the Curiosity a decade on Mars live stream, a public talk, live streamed on the 22nd of July 2022. And of course, I'll include the link to the video on YouTube in the description below. So all screenshots and images are credit NASA JPL. Curiosity Project Scientist at NASA JPL, Dr. Ashwin Vasada took us through the presentation and you also said something really interesting. We've checked all the boxes in many of these drill holes, especially in the ones that come from these environments where lakes once were, we found really abundant evidence for habitable environments. So present tense, habitable environments. I do encourage you to check out the video, folks. It's really interesting. Check out the stunning colors in these photographs that they made public, guys. We've always been shown these photographs with this puke red filter over the top. But check this out. This is uh, absolutely stunning stuff. Also, you'll see that I've included the timestamp from where I took the screenshot. Next up, check out the blue sky. This is an awesome view of the dried out lake bed and river. There again, we can see some dust cloud activity. And again, note the stunning colors, very vivid. We've got a blue or bluish type of uh, atmosphere once again. And there again, folks, check out the color in this and uh, these strange narrow mineral deposits also very different in color it's quite amazing that they keep these photographs for themselves i'm amazed that they actually revealed these in this presentation currently the rover is located roughly in this position this is the photograph taken by the rover on Sol 23, looking up to where the rover is right now. And again, note the very vivid colors and the bluish sky there in the background. Check out the sky in this one, folks. It looks like a photograph that was taken here on Earth, doesn't it? It's very, very interesting. This is also where I found the entranceway or doorway, as NASA calls it. And there again, check out that deep blue sky and the excellent colors in this photograph. Here's a view of where the rover is presently, looking back at the landing site highlighted over here to the left. The vivid colors in these photographs is absolutely amazing. So here are some of those photographs highlighting the blue atmosphere or sky on Mars. So why does NASA always release these photographs on the rover sites with this red filter applied? Why not just release them as they are in true color? Is this potentially another form of soft disclosure from NASA JPL? Once again, the quote from Dr. Ashwin Vasada, we've checked all the boxes in many of these drill holes, especially the ones that come from the environments where lakes once were, we found really abundant evidence of habitable environments. Note the present tense. Please let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Take care everybody. I'll see you soon. Bye bye for now.